pleasure and information, I have brought with me to the studio a minigun. Jesus. Yes, that's right. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to take you through the maintenance, mechanics, uh, basic information, knowledge about the minigun, so you'll be better prepared to use this weapon. I'm just going to grab it. It's just kind of weird because, you know, he's got this glazed look on his eye here with this fucking minigun. Fucking heavy. All right. Here's the minigun. It is. That's a beautiful weapon, though. I got to be honest with you. I'm telling you. Have look you... at this. I cleaned it last night. Have you been working out? I, well. You look you know, good. Uh, when you picked thanks. that up, I saw the guns. You saw that, I huh? saw them. The pythons. Well, it, it, this helps. It's like this... working with a jackhammer. Exactly. Without the jacking. All right. Going to walk you through this. All right. First thing you do. You grab the chamber handle, you're going to want to lock and load this thing, all right? Just like that, you hear the sound, and you are ready to fight. Just push it out it. Pull it off. Take your hand off the trigger, Vinny. Hold, 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 I got it, I got it, got it, got it, I'm sorry. How many times you want to shoot the new oh, intern? You know, how many, you know how hard it is to get an intern with cans like that? I'm... I didn't. I thought the safety was on. Very important, ladies and gentlemen. Keep the safety on. Hey, you're leaking titty juice on my sandwich there, sweet tits. I'm yep. not paying for that, hoagie. Okay, listen. Um, Jesus, I'm you're gonna sorry. clean that up. That's you. I'm I not will taking, clean it up. I'm not taking a rap for this one. You're gonna have to explain to the boss why you thought it was appropriate to shoot the intern in a titty with a minigun. That comes out of this show's liquor bill. What? You heard what I said. Listen, normally, this sort of thing doesn't happen, all right? This way, you can learn through our mistakes. Oh, this never happens. What about the time that we had the Paradise City coach, the rugby coach up here, and you were showing off with your flamethrower, and you burned his head off, and you thought it was funny? Well, well you laughed at him on radio. <laughs> Did you see his hair? It was funny, but it, I, it I didn't. Was. You know, I don't think it's appropriate, you know, to make fun of a guy who's on fire. You know, you wanted to piss, hey, let's piss his head off. I said, no, let's put it out. I was the eye of reasonables. You can't do a radio show and do a part of that radio show and bring up weapons and shoot people who aren't expecting to get shot. You know, we had the, we had that, that tour come through here wanting to see the studio, you know, live broadcast of Gear Talk Radio. All the fans came up here, and you came in with a bunch of homing rockets, all right? You'd been drinking, and you drove your car down the hallway and then parked it next to me and told the boss that I did it. I told the receptionist clearly the day before that I was going to be doing this and to keep everyone clear of the hallway. Writing a note on a missile and shooting it at the receptionist does not count as a memo. It does when it sticks to the desk. Now you're just getting technical. This will be, the, I swear to God, this is the last time you bring a weapon up in here. Uh, you've got, you've killed so many people. You know, last week you wanted to do the laser mines, right? And you thought it was funny, you know. We had that Cuban intern guy that didn't speak English, and you just said, Hey, Babalu, and he comes screaming down the hallway and hit that laser thing, and boo yeah, you blew him up into the ceiling fan and laughed. Laughed about it, and then you came over to me and said, Hey, you want to listen to this? I taped it. That's not funny. That's not good radio, all right? You know, that's not my problem. Because you were drinking and brought a weapon to work. That that's Oh, okay, that's yes. a real good leg. Run with that. The lawyer's going to just get you off on that when you tell the judge, yeah, I was the guy who uh, brought a bolt gun and electrocuted six cats outside the radio station as a promo. It's reasonable. You did that, though. I did. I think that's a retributional. All right, listen, you just listen. Promise me right now. To me and all our listeners, that you are never going to bring any weapons in again. All right? After today. All right. Well, you've already brought in a minigun. I mean, that's done. Well, that's th that's one of the things I you brought. You brought more weapons in. Well, yeah. This no. is weapon day. Please tell me you're joking. This is... Don't no. List. What? You're telling me that uh, if if I were to have, uh, say, a lunchbox full of hand grenades, oh my that, God. Uh, that would be a bad thing? Yes, I think it would be a bad thing if you had a lunchbox full of hand grenades, Vinny. Take a look at them. Oh, those, hey, those are nice. I huh? Like those. See? You know, it's hard, Vinny, to be the drunkest one, but the responsible one. Yeah, I know. Hey, okay. hot potato. Hey, whoa. Hey, where's, all right, where's the pin? Where's the pin, Vinny? Well, the pin's right here. Open the fucking window. We got like three seconds here. Hot, heads up. Oh, God, that that window. Yeah, sorry. Hey, I got an idea. Give me one of those. All right, check this out. Throw it out the window. Hey, buddy, little help, huh? He's gonna go get it. Ow! Ooh! Good eye! Good eye! Whoa, alright, how many grenades we got left there? 
Uh, let's see. I brought uh, the, my usual baker's dozen. All right. Uh, so th- two away. That leaves uh, 11. All right. Uh, turn this mic off real quick. Hey, listen, what we're going to do is I'm going to have a radio promo thing. Just go with me, all right? Okay. All right. My mic back on, please. Right. All right. 96.2 Gear Talk Radio, 555-4327. want to invite all the listeners to come hang out in the parking lot. We are going to have a concert in which Mason is going to play live tonight. Totally free concert, free beer, and the first 1,000 people to come get $1,000 each. So come on down to 96.2 Gear Talk Radio, the parking lot. Try to stand underneath the open window on the seventh floor. That's where Mason will be doing his guitar solo. And uh, me and Vinny will be there uh, throwing out prizes. Chocolate hand grenades for everyone. There'll be a big red circle right on the sidewalk where you need to be. All right, I think that'll work. Yeah. Yeah, huh? Get some people down here and put some T-shirts on some fans. Marketing genius, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to be giving out free T-shirts. We're going to wrap them inside. We're going to take the grenades and put them inside a T-shirt cannon. We're going to fire them from the seventh floor of our building. One of the grenades will be live. The other nine are going to be with the pins to the fans. Whoever gets the grenade without the pin loses. Classic. You know, I got a complaint right now. Uh, Uh Uh-oh. I'm a little steamed.